Hey, it's Tom Christie here with a quick walkthrough of the World Carving Championships in Ocean City, Maryland. It's uh, going on right now, and this is day one of the competition, um, actually from Friday. And I'm just doing a quick walkthrough. You can't see a lot of details here, but I wanted to give you a feel for what's at the show. There's James Company. Uh, here are the World Pairs. It's the Canada Goose this year, a single goose. There's the world interpretive category. I'm going to slide on over here to some of the other categories. And let's walk over to this uh, area. Here's some of the life-size uh, wildfowl decorative carvings. Those are the world rig and many of those rigs are on their way out uh, to the bay to be judged. Here's that wood duck, single wood duck world category. I think there were 21 entries in the wood duck. There's Tom Matus. Here's some of the other uh, gunning decoy categories. Pairs. Some more gunning decoys. Let's keep on going here. You can see there's quite a few gunning pairs working our way down to the uh, gunning pairs champion category there. All of the judging is underway, so there are no results uh, to be posted right now. I just wanted to provide a walkthrough. Here's some of the beautiful uh, decorative work on the tables. I know many of you couldn't attend, so I thought it would be helpful just to show a few views from the show. This is the uh, World Decorative Life-Size category. More gunning decoys. Here's some of the shorebird decoys. Here's some of the, the antique decoys, or made to look like antiques. More gunning pairs. There are their shuttling uh, world rig entries out to the bay to be judged. There's another section of the convention center that was opened up this year. It's created a lot more additional space. There's the palm frond category. You can see there's a lot of uh, empty space because there's just so much more room this year. Just walking down some of the decorative categories here, waterfowl, some more shorebird. It's a shorebird category. Swing around the end here and uh, go over to the fish carving area. So you can take a look at that real quick. Some nice entries there. Now we're jumping outside and this is the uh, judging going on of, for the world rig. And those are the rigs. You can see it was a pretty calm day on the bay. And so there, was, there wasn't a huge test on the flotation of the decoys um, because the chop just wasn't there this year. So it's a nice calm day, bright sunny day as well. Here it got a little rougher later in the morning and this is that wood duck category, the 21 wood ducks out there being judged head to head. Great category. There's a, the five judges on the barge a lot of work by the bird handlers putting decoys out. This this is, uh, I think, later a gunning pairs category. Just give you a feel for how they're judged out in the bay under natural lighting and wave and tide conditions. Just a shot down from above. Some of the entries is they're being prepped to being put on the barge. So the judging is done from a barge so that they can uh, see all angles around the decoys as they're floating in the bay.
and some of the crowd and spectators uh, enjoying the day. The beautiful sunny warm day today in Ocean City. We're getting a little bit of chop there later in the day. Uh, this was uh, as they were moving the barge out for the the gunning pairs competition. Um, and again, the bird, the uh, barge handlers did a great job. Just keep the judges at a distance to the decoy so they can be judged. Here's a flyover that I just happened to happen while I was out there, and it was great to see the the live birds going over while while the decoys were being judged down below. But a great first day. I'm not posting results. I'm just again trying to give you a feel for what it's like at the competition.